What is up, everybody? Welcome back to another video. And as you can see by the title, it's your boy Texas Chris reacting to Mom caught shoplifting with her small kid. What was she stealing? Let's get into it. On April 20th, 2022, the Chambly police received a call from Von Maurer's store in Atlanta, Georgia, reporting a shoplifting incident involving a woman. Responding quickly, an officer arrived at the scene to find a distressed woman with her small child inside the store's loss prevention room. Hello. Hi. What's your name? Oh, a little shy. Sorry, dude. Oh, she's crying. Yeah, video. Uh, yes. Um, okay. Yeah. Just, I'm so sorry. Like, I'm going to be arrested. Uh, that's based off your actions. Okay. Okay. Do you have the price for the items? Oh yes. Um, one second. Yeah, it's it's based on the price and it's based on your actions. Okay. I just had him. Is there somebody else to get him? Is there somebody else to get him? Of course, of course. I just, I'm, just, I'm so stupid. I don't know what's wrong with me. You did it to yourself. Hey, buddy. 31 shotgun. Can you run an OLM out of Georgia? Oh, my God. So... Can I... Can I put your pattern down already? Not yet. Can, can I just pat you down just for a minute? Um, I don't like that for me to do it. But... Tears streaming down her face, the woman approached the officer and pleaded if there was any way to avoid going to jail. Nope. Unfortunately, due to the value of the stolen items exceeding $400, the officers explained that they couldn't take that route. I just asked them if they have it on camera. I've been in uh, here for little, okay. like 15 seconds. So, for what it comes to the little one, do you have anyone that can come back? I'm trying to figure out how to say something. Okay. All right, take a breath. Take a breath. So, uh, we're doing you the favor right now, or you're not in handcuffs. Okay. 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 Depending on what they say, how much everything is, all that stuff. Understanding the challenging situation, the officers advised her to call someone who could pick up the child. So, so in this okay. situation, and you just think fast because there's someone that can pick up your little one because we don't want defects to have to come No, I know that's what. Okay. okay. So, I'm so, okay. Breathe for him. Be cool for him. Okay. Okay. Um, why well, do you have a seat for us? Have a seat. Because if you're freaked freak out, it's going to freak him out. So just... is, is there no other option? And you know what? That's almost a felony. Yeah. If it was... Oh my God, if, if it was, If it was... If it wasn't that much, I'd be... I'd be willing to work through that, but that, that's, oh that's a substantial okay, I'm amount. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. I'm losing it right now. So you got caught stealing. Still it. For him? You got caught stealing it. Now you're trying to get out of it. I guess. Yep. Okay. Um... Fortunately, she was able to reach her sister, who agreed to come and take care of the child. I mean, I really don't know what to do. Just I'm sorry. I've been doing a lot kids. That's why I came. Yep, that's what I figured. I got you. Um, so you're going to have to do, get the little one's name and all that stuff. Mm -hmm. See if she can get somebody to come out. Yep. Um, Treat it like just any kind of thing. Um, but how long do I have to like, get somebody here? As soon as you kill me, okay, possibly. We live in Carrollton. Everybody I know is in Carrollton. Okay. Oh, yes. In a remarkable yes. act of compassion, a female officer decided to go above and beyond. She volunteered to stay with the child until the sister arrived, ensuring the child's well being during this difficult time. W cop. Well, I can't. So the whole thing is like, on our end, we don't have three million officers in Donwoody. Mm -hmm. um, so. More than like I can chill with him for a little bit. Oh my god. Uh, <laughs> Sorry. But, um, oh my god. The whole thing is that we can't, like, we can't have two officers off the road for people to come to the And I know it's. So, so I would rather just... be cool and hang out with him for a little bit than having to have oh my god. him go was, somewhere with a two seat stranger. But if you can please, please, please find somebody like ASAP. Okay. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Because we're doing you a favor by letting you, like, call somebody else with some. Okay. What's, what's the little one's name? Drake. Drake? Yes. Does he have the same last name? Champagne Poppy. What's his birthday? 
Um, his birth date is um, eight, nine, um, 19. I'm sorry. I forgot this one. I seriously don't That's understand bad. why. Well, you are super handsome. And mommy's okay. Mommy's okay. Mommy's just going to hang out with my friend for a little bit. That's all. You're be okay. Yeah, I'm going to Cap. <laughs> I'll give you the answer. Whatever you can call sweetheart, because we don't want to. I would. I really don't want to go the other route, so whoever you can get to come get him. Should I answer? No, that's not done. I don't know, know what done is. I seriously. I don't know. Have you ever done this before? I'm oh, so sorry. What's she Like, where'd she put it? Yeah. Sure. I don't know. I haven't gotten it. Where she put yeah, it? She concealed it in her stroller with the fold up canopy, and some of it was in a, a bag that she has underneath the stroller. What did and she And she concealed steal? it in the bathroom, and then, then again in the uh, fitting room with our dresses. I really didn't put anything in the bathroom. What's she working on getting the footage put on a desk? Oh my gosh. Okay. I'm so okay. sorry. I'm trying to call. I'll go there if you want to go talk to her. Okay. Like, it's your so if you, whatever you want to bring with you, oh. everything else, we'll leave here and we'll give it to your sister when she gets here. Okay. okay. I guess I'm just going to take my phone. Okay. Mm -hmm. oh. And I'll leave my wallet. Yes. Okay. That's cool. Yeah, the quicker you get down there, the better, because as soon as she gets okay. here, okay. that will get processed. It will, because you have to get processed to be able to get out. Okay. Yeah. So let's... I'm not trying to, you know. I'm sorry. You know, you can help me with that. Yep. This is her property, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. This leaf? Do you want to, is that going to go to the car later? Okay. You'll see it all there. Okay. Do you want to say goodbye to him? It's warm out. You probably won't do that. Yeah. So we're going to stay in here. Mom, Mom's going to go with my friend for a little bit, okay? And Auntie, Aunt Carrie's going to come and get you, okay? Hey, I'm just going to be right back, okay? Stealing with an LV purse. Is it real, though? Probably not. But stealing with an LV purse is crazy. Put your son in a predicament to be like that, bro. better than me because I don't have the patience. Yeah, she don't know how to play that. Right.
wouldn't be the first time if you do. <laughs> I don't think you will. Okay, let's go ahead and have it. 31, one in custody. Put you in my car. I do got to take your purse, and I do have to search you. So go and grab it from me. And whenever you get to the jail, you get everything back. Okay. Go ahead and move forward. Me. Okay. I'm gonna do a pat down. I'm gonna use the back side of my hand, okay? You don't have anything on you. I'm gonna check your waistline. Staying. What? The handcuffs are staying. Yeah, yeah. I can't. I can't remove them. It's policy. I, I know you're cooperating, I'm but that, I'm sorry. Am I looking that way for me? Yeah. I feel like you're not gonna get out today. You, if you get bonded out, yes, okay. you can get bonded out today, yes. So we'll have. Check out the fit. She got her own clouds. She got leggings. She got a a high tech jacket that's rainproof in the sun. She has a fitted cap, earrings, LB purse. Anybody can steal, I guess. That's crazy. What happen is we'll go to the jail, you'll get booked, and you'll get processed, and then after situation. that, they can bond you out, okay? Okay. So these are the forms from Von Mar. They will be put with your property. It's pretty much saying, don't come back here again or you'll be arrested, okay? Um, and I just have to search your purse, make sure you don't, you're not gonna be bringing any contraband into the jail. The woman was formally charged with shoplifting and later transported to the DeKalb County Jail. No one's perfect, Must we all make mistakes. Oh, this is so stupid. I literally have money in the bank to pay for this stuff. Like, why wouldn't I? I don't have that answer. I'm, I'm sorry. Like, I know better. <laughs> well, um, you know, just, just you better look like next time. Oh, you know, And my phone's still up there on the dash. Yeah, I know. Okay. I'm just emptying out these pills. Okay. You know, it's, no one's perfect. Everyone makes a mistake, but, you know, whenever you make a mistake, you gotta pay for the consequences. I know, it's just, I'm so sorry that other people are so disappointed. <laughs> My my sister and then my poor kid and they are crying. Do I mean this is just uh, not okay? It's not okay. I cannot believe I've done this to myself. <laughs> Do you? Uh, Girl, can you radio the girl that's with my with my son and see if he's okay? There's a kid you not. If you, I mean, I know I don't know what you can and can't do. I'm sorry. I, I can't do it. I'm not gonna do that over the radio. Okay. Uh, just because my bosses are listening to all that. Yeah. But I will send her a text. Thank you. You're welcome. W. Uh, my partner, Miss Hernandez. She said he's okay. He stopped crying. Okay. Thank so you. He's doing good. <laughs> she used to be a social worker. She was a social worker for, I think, over a decade. So, she, your son's in good hands. There's just no reason for this. This is like so unacceptable. It's your no fault. Reason. I mean, this is, it's your fault. There's nobody's fault. I mean, why would I think it'd be okay to do this and do put my, I mean, much my kid? Well, let me ask you this. What can you do about it now? <sighs> you know. Nothing. I have a saying that I always that I always tell myself whenever I get worked up, and it's no amount of anxiety can predict the future, and no amount of regret can change the past. You know, 
you can be ashamed of yourself and you can hate yourself for what you did, but the thing is though, you cannot go back and you cannot change your actions. You did what you did and it's unfortunate and it, it's unfortunate for numerous reasons. One of them being is that you put your kid in a bad spot. <laughs> yep. But the thing is though, you cannot do anything about that right now. All you can do now is move forward and work on improving things and bettering yourself as a person. Not just for your sake, but also for your children's sake. So you're not going to be put in a situation like this again. You know, it's, people make mistakes. No one's perfect. Uh, it's all about whenever you make mistakes, are you going to keep making the same mistakes? Or are you going to learn your lesson? Are you going to learn from it? Better yourself. <sighs> So you're going to go right there between those two red poles. Just stay behind the yellow line. Alright, that's going to wrap the video up. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. I think she put herself in a bad situation along with her son. But the comments say this is a starving this is not a starving mother stealing food for her child. She is selling luxury items. She is hundred percent responsible. Agreed. There isn't one item in the entire store that is worth listening to that little boy cry for his mom. Facts like that. The female officer was so amazing and compassionate here. She seemed more concerned for him than the mother did. That is crazy. But if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, subscribe, hit the bell. Take the Chris, we sign in up and uh peace.